Welcome to another session of our Mass Effect 1 playthrough. We're here on Vermeer, just chilling in the Solarian camp. I think the next thing we have to do is go talk to the captain, tell him we're ready. Um, I did sell a couple of things to this merchant. Most of it I turned into Omni Gel. Um, but we didn't really have a lot of items, to be honest. Um, it felt like we did, but there, there wasn't a lot of stuff that we had, so. Um, I've, we've already talked to all of our squad mates. We looked around here. The last thing we did was we calmed down Rex, so he doesn't go all ballistic. Um, the next thing that we have to do is... Prepare your team for the assault on Saren's base when you're ready to talk to Captain Kire. Or whatever his name is. Probably not even his name. But I think he's right there. Uh, and we'll talk to him and we'll get started. Not feeling like dying anymore like I did on Friday, so progress. Normally I wouldn't think much of Solarians in a firefight, but these soldiers seem well trained. Yeah, we might get to see some Solarians in action here. It won't be an easy fight, but we're ready when you are. Nice work with Rex. I didn't think anyone would calm it down. Alright. What does Rex say? Does he say anything else? Probably not. If we're doing this, then let's go. Oh, he's ready. So, I'm assuming this is the area that we're gonna go... ...through when it is time. It's like a like a sewer thing. All right, let's go talk to the captain, Captain Solarian, and tell him that we are ready. Um, and let's see what he has to say. Oh, is there anything in here? I don't even think I checked. Oh, what do you soldiers say? Strange. It's rare to see a Krogan accept reason. You command exceptional loyalty. Only a fool accepts the word of a Krogan. <laughs> hey, that's my friend you're talking about. Your Krogan may change his mind when he sees the extent of the facility. Let's hope not. Did you ever find out what happened to Rex's armor it was so good? No, but I I'm assuming that for this area. Because there's like cutscenes and stuff happening, maybe he doesn't have it on, but uh, as soon as we like make our way to do the assault, he'll probably have it back on. It's just for whatever reason, this area, maybe they didn't have the, the uh, different types of armor put in place or something, I don't know. He'll, he'll get it back though. Thank you for speaking with the Krogan. The assault on Saren's base will be difficult enough as it is. The assault. Do you think that you'll be doing the rest of the series? Says, uh, can you say my name? Yes. We. This is the whole point of us playing through Mass Effect is for the hype for Andromeda. Although I don't know now if we'll finish all three games by the time Andromeda comes out, but you know, it, it's fine. We're, we'll 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 get to it when we get to it. But yeah, when we finish with Mass Effect One, probably sometime this week, maybe in the next day or two we'll be starting mass effect 2 and then after that we'll go to mass effect 3 well, it's gonna be awesome but yeah i think i think we'll um we'll probably be finishing up mass effect 3 by the time andromeda comes out i think um which isn't going to be too bad because that'll give people time to play through the game and then maybe when i stream it i'll have a better chance of getting some new viewers in here or something but we'll see we still got about like a month to go until it's out so we've played this game for maybe like two weeks or something i assume that means you've come up with a plan of sorts we can convert our ship's drive system into a 20 kiloton ordnance crude but effective nice drop that nuke from orbit and saren can kiss his turian ass goodbye unfortunately the facility is too well fortified for that We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Where? 
Where do we take the nuke? And how do we get there? The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. He's right. It does sound a bit risky. Is there no other way? No, but I think we can work around that. I'm going to divide my men into three teams and hit the front of the facility. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. Shadow team. Uh, works for me. You'll all be killed. It's a good idea, but your people are going to get slaughtered. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive. And that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me. To help coordinate the teams. Uh... Who's that going to be, though? We'll need someone who knows Alliance communication protocols. I volunteer, Commander. Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. I'll go with the Solarians. With all due respect, Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. Why is it that whenever someone says, with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? <laughs> She's not wrong. Not wrong about that statement. Captain, who do you, who do you need? Who would be better suited to the mission? Either of these two will do, Commander. Both seem willing to sacrifice their lives if necessary. Though if we are lucky, such sacrifices won't be required. So I don't know if this part actually matters. Um, his opinion is either of them will do. Caden might be better to, to set the bomb. Because uh, I doubt Ashley knows what to do with bombs. She just knows how to kill things. Um... I guess we'll say take Ashley. Because Ashley's going to be with this Solarian and they're going to be doing like combat stuff. So I think Ashley would probably be better suited um, for that. Anyway, I think we need to take Caden with us to the bomb. Let's take... Uh, you can take Ashley, I guess. Williams. You'll accompany the captain. No heroics, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I will have the ordinance loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, Commander? Sure, let's talk about, uh, let's talk about the nuke. I want to know more about the bomb. How reliable is it going to be? Its reliability depends on the person arming it, but it will do the job. The drive system is highly impervious to damage from external sources. Once it has been armed, very little can stop it. The key is getting it into place and armed before the Geth can stop us. Ser uh, so <laughs> I thought that said Saren exit plan. Solarian exit plan. The Normandy's picking me up. How will your teams escape the blast? We will engage the Geth as long as possible. Once the bomb is in place, we will fall back to try and escape the blast radius. If we move quickly, we should be able to escape with acceptable casualties. If not, then our memories will live on as martyrs to a greater cause. Sounds dangerous. You talk like this is a suicide mission. I won't lie to you, Commander. There is a chance none of us will survive this assault, even your team. But we do what is necessary. Tell me about the other teams. Shadow seems clear enough. What will the other teams be called? Eigor, Manovai, and Jeto. They were the initial settlements on our first three colony worlds. They are at the heart of Solarian territory to oh, this nice. day. These names will remind my men what they are fighting for. They must have a personal stake in the fight if we are to have any chance of success. Okay. The last thing to do is recap the mission. I think it's clear. But let's hear what he has to say again. Give me a quick rundown of the plan again. You are Team Shadow. We will create a distraction while you infiltrate the base. Make your way to the breeding grounds at the heart of the facility. Disable the AA guns so the Normandy can land and deliver the nuke. If we get that far, we'll try to help you with guns, but don't count on it. Once you have the bomb, place it next to the geothermal taps. Then get out before it detonates. Okay, so I think we made the right choice in having Ashley go with this guy. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's do it. I'm ready when you are, Captain. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. Well, this is it. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone, LT. You too, Commander. 
We'll be fine. You'll see. Yeah, I just... Good luck. What is it? Is there something you want to say, Chief? I, I don't know. It's just weird. Going under someone else's command. I've got used to working with you. All of you. Don't worry. We'll see you on the other side. I know. I... It's been an honor serving with you, Commander. We're a team. It doesn't matter if we're not in the same unit. We're still a team. Watch each other's backs, keep your eyes open, and fight like I know you can. We'll all come out of this in one piece. You bet, Commander. You all know the mission and what is at stake. I have come to trust each of you with my life. But I have also heard murmurs of discontent. I share your concerns. We are trained for espionage. We would be legends, but the records are sealed. Glory in battle is not our way. Think of our heroes. A silent step defeated a nation with a single shot. Or the ever alert who kept armies at bay with hidden rats. These giants do not seem to give us solace here, but they are not all that we are. Before the network, there was the fleet. Before diplomacy, there were soldiers. Our influence stopped the Rachni, but before that, we held the line. Our influence stopped the Krogan, but before that, we held the line. We held the line. Our influence will stop Saren. In the battle today, we will hold the line. Good luck, Commander. I hope we will meet again. Awesome. All right, I think I know who we're taking with us. We're going to take Caden. And I think because... Because there was talk about a cure for the genophage, I feel like we should take our, our pal Rex with us. So I think Caden and Rex are going to see the action here. Um, I'm actually surprised that... Caden is not a, like, you have to take him sort of guy, but I don't know. We'll go ahead and take him, because I feel like it just seems right. Um, and we'll take Rex. So our biotic and our combat strength is there. I think we'll be fine. I think this is good. But let's do it. I would like to take Rex if I could, but... I feel like Caden and, and uh, or Garrus, I meant. I feel like Caden and Rex are pretty suitable for this. Let's do it. That armor. Object. Do you read me, Commander? Affirmative. Loud and clear. Good. We'll start our push. We'll try to make it to the AA guns, but it might be up to you to finish the job. And Commander, if you see any way to undermine their defenses, we could definitely use the help. For sure. Alright, Rex got a sexy armor back. This is my kind of vacation. Lots of scenery, and lots of killing. <laughs> Sun, surf, sand, and geth. I bet they don't put that in the brochure. <laughs> Okay, well, it's been a while since we've used Caden, uh, so let's get him some good stuff, I guess. Uh, electronics and I think those are good. Any kind of loot we find, we should be able to unlock. Um, let's go ahead and put some points into... Actually, I kind of just want to get lift and throw max on him. So let's go ahead and do that. He is a fellow biotic like myself. Uh, I've already used all our points. We're also level 50, which is the cap. So we can't level up anymore. My paragon's all the way up. So I feel good about that. Let's double check Caden's stuff here. I think the only thing he can use is a pistol. Uh, which is interesting. 
But I think he's more like a engineer, I think. So put a couple of these on. Um In terms of armor, yeah, he doesn't really have anything good. So, but yeah. All right. It's time. Wait, what's in the codex that's blinking that we have not read? Alien Races Council. What is that? Solarian's Government. Militar military Doctrine. Okay. I don't care about reading those right now. So we are at the base approach. We have to go to the com communications tower, I think. Dang, this is a lot. It's a lot of stuff. All right, and the journal says they are attacking the base head on in hopes of diverting the attention of the Geth. Or your primary mission is to infiltrate the base unseen. He asks us to keep an eye out for ways to frustrate and slow down Geth defenses. Okay, so we need to make sure that we. Uh, are sneaky, I guess. This is my kind of vacation. Lots of and any time that we see lots of Shadow is on the ground. Repeat, oh. Shadow is on the ground. Chief Williams with A Gore team. Manovine, Teato teams, move. Time to get some attention. If we can find a way to slow things down, we'll do that. Crossfire. Check for long-range turrets helping the Geth target. I've lost shields. Whoa! Uh -oh. I ain't dying today. Oh, lucky. Okay. Da -da -da. Triangulation towers. Is there anything else here? kind of weapons probably crappy weapons but we'll take it all right let's disable this awesome get the communications disrupted so that's gonna help our bros out on the on the ground floor I guess we'll heals freaking Caden is what what does Caden have in his uh, armor set exoskeleton Actually, get this. This is probably better. And then we'll give him combat exoskeleton. All right. Quick save failed. Why? There's an enemy down here. <laughs> Hi. I don't know how he got down there, but he did. All clear. Okay. Now we should be able to quick save. Something scrambled, they're targeting. We got a shot. Chief Williams, take the heat off my life. Awesome. Da -da 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 -da. Oh yeah, the combat sim was definitely Vermeer bits, yeah. The uh pinnacle station combat stuff. Dude, I'm surprised we got through that stuff as quick as we did. It was it was totally worth it though. So we could get our own apartment. Um I wouldn't mind going this way, but let's go this way first. Ooh. Hello. We're calling shot strikes. Jayeto, watch for comm stations. Williams, can you see anything? They're calling satellite strikes? Well, there's a satellite umpleak tower there, so we'll, t we'll help that out. What weapon is Caden using? No, Caden, you need to use your pistol, because you're not trained in that. Yeah. There we go. Do -do. Ooh, hello. Apparently I damaged the satellite uplink. 
Oh, it's right there. Nice. Where did he come from? Whoa! I have never seen that before. I've never seen a enemy go that high. Turns out Caden is actually pretty good. All right, I want to walk back this way just to see if there's anything real quick. So we disrupted Geth communications and the satellite stuff. I've lost shields. Uh oh. It's been like three or four sessions since. I died. I'm gonna do my best to keep that up today. Alright. There's a couple of geth over here. Let's kill these guys. Alright. So all this area is clear. Let's go back. Before we go up that, uh, the ramp over here, I want to take a look at the journal real quick because when we disrupted the Geth communications and the satellite uplink, uh, we got journal entries. Bum, 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 bum. Well, so far, we've gotten into some fights, but for the most part, I think we're doing a pretty good job of being sneaky-ish. Okay. Uh, disrupted, destroy satellite uplink. Okay, cool. Yep. Yep, this was definitely out of the combat simulator right here. Aircraft heading to perimeter stations to recharge. Bunker up before they come back. Definitely. This portion right here. Whoa, there's so many little ways to go. Let's go this way. Uh-oh. Who's throwing stuff at me? Is there a guy over here? Oh, yeah, there is. Gets destroyed. <laughs> nice. This is a dead end, right? Yeah. Ah, the sound of water. Okay, let's go up the ramp and kill this dude. There is a... No, that's the dead end. Okay, that's fine. Open out. So... Yeah, th she said something about refueling, so we need to go over there and take that out. Um, we'll go ahead and stay on the path. Uh, here. And then when we're done, we'll quickly check the bottom. I don't think there's going to be anything there. I don't know what that is, but I'm not going over there yet. It's like a place where we can snipe if we wanted to or something. Um, I want to go this way. Who shot that? That was amazing. Get out of here. I'm over here trying to snipe them with the shotgun. Hey, man. I probably should have swapped my pistol for a little bit. Let's do that. Nope, wrong one. Gotta go up to the pistol. Okay. 
Um. I guess we'll go this way. So we can get some more calm chatter over here. Hear what's going on. Ooh. Mr. Geth. over here. There's a guy over here. Trogan warrior. There we go. Oh, he's not dead? Okay, now he is. Clear. Okay, let's take a look over here. I think there was an area where you could snipe if you wanted to, but I'm not trained in that, so I can't use that. Da, 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 da. You're gonna be gone for a half an hour or so? Okay. Yeah, we'll still be here when you get back. I keep, I keep hearing these popping sounds from the gunfire. Keep thinking like I'm low on HP because it makes that like uh, that heart noise, the beating heart. Okay, so we made it to the research facility. We're gonna go back and check down below here to see if there's any loot or anything. Uh, I kind of want to go over here and check out this little eye point. upgrade kit so yeah this would have been a little place to kind of snipe these guys or shoot that if you wanted sun surf sand and geth and geth <laughs> i bet they don't put that in the brochure uh we came that way i think there's a little down point right here yeah let's go down here To roam the waters here. Uh, pick down here. Yeah, there's literally nothing down here. Okay. Well, I we wasted a couple minutes doing that, but that's alright. Alright, let's go enter the research facility and see what's happening. That, did our journal update or no? Destroyed Geth Flyers. Okay. I don't think there's anything down there. Just briefly check, I guess. It's right here. See if there's anything hidden down here. Oh, hello. Easy decryption. Hold the line, men. Hold the line. Hold the line. Facility entrance, facility entrance. Where what's the difference here? Assault. Disable the AA guns. Is there a reason that I should go in this door instead of this one? Uh, let's see what happens. Hold the line, famous last words. Does this go inside the facility, or...? It looks like it. 
maintenance bay. Okay, where does this other side go then? Because there's no indicators on where to go. I know we have to go inside the base, but... I don't know, maybe that other side is sneakier, I guess. Probably it makes more sense to go on that other side, I bet. Yeah, yeah, let's go on that other side. That makes more sense to me is to go down and here and be sneaky about it. We don't need XP or anything because we're already at the level cap. So I don't 